Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are announcing our intention to prohibit the inclusion of Huawei and ZTE's products and services in Canada's telecommunications systems. This follows a full review by our security agencies and in consultation with our closest allies. Let me be very clear. We will always protect the safety and security of Canadians and will take any actions necessary to safeguard our telecommunication infrastructure. Telecommunication companies in Canada will not be permitted to include in their networks products or services that put our national security at risk. Providers who already have this equipment installed will be required to cease its use and remove it under the plans we are announcing today. This plan will make our network safer, not only for now, but for generations to come. Well, let me be very clear to Canadians. Uh, tonight, we intend to exclude Huawei and ZTE from our 5G network, full stop. Um, I would say that this has never been a race. This is about taking the right decision. This is about providing a framework to protect our infrastructure, and I would say in a 5G world, in the Internet of Things, at a time where we rely more and more in our daily lives from the, our network, uh, this is uh, the right decision. Beyond today's announcement, we will table legislation in the very short term to further strengthen our telecommunication system and protect our national security. We will soon introduce a new framework to protect critical infrastructure in the finance, telecommunications, energy, and transport sectors. This new legislation will establish a framework to better protect the systems vital to our national security and give the government a new tool to respond to emerging cyber threats. And this is part of a robust strategy to defend Canada and the crucial infrastructure that Canadians rely on every single day.